next week on G. Now at six, tropical storm Barry moves into the state tonight with heavy rain likely. Plus, the Hot Springs Village Animal Welfare League receiving a huge grant from a popular pet store. How they plan to use the money to get more pets ready for adoption. And an arrest is made in the suspicious death of a retired Fort Smith school teacher. What hurts me the most is that they had to hurt him. How his family used technology to help police catch the suspect. The news starts now. From the station that's on your side, this is Channel 7 News, awarded the National Edward R. Murrow Award for Newscast Excellence. Hurricane Barry moving on shore with strong force winds and heavy rain in Louisiana. Floodwaters pushing over the tops of levees in southeast Louisiana with strong winds tearing down trees and power lines. Barry has now been downgraded to a tropical storm, but Arkansas is still in its track. Meteorologist James Bryant keeping up with this changing information about the storm. James. Janelle, yes, it has been downgraded back to a tropical storm, but it really doesn't matter. Hurricane, tropical storm, the impacts remain the same. Don't get bogged down in what the system actually is. We're seeing the outer bands move across Arkansas this afternoon. Some of these locally heavy at times. The radar lit up like a Christmas tree this afternoon. Scattered showers all over the place, but in between you're getting glimpses of sun, and it is back to being very humid outside. A few of those heavier showers just moved through downtown and now into western Pulaski County.